Western Canada. This is KSBS Public Television. Comfort and support. Hope and healing. Family to family. Generation upon generation. We walk the journey with you through the celebration of life. Hennessy Valley Funeral Home and Crematory. HennessyValley.com. Proud to support KSPS. Nothing's riding on this except the First Amendment to the Constitution, freedom of the press, and maybe the future of the country. Jason Robards, Robert Redford, and Dustin Hoffman star in All the President's Men. Welcome to Saturday Night Cinema screening of the 1976 political drama All the President's Men, the four Oscar-winning story of the Watergate investigation that led to the resignation of President Richard M. Nixon. I'm your host, Sean Higgins. The Pointer Institute for Media Studies ranks tonight's movie as the best film yet made about media, putting it ahead of classics like Citizen Kane, Spotlight, and Network, and noting its depth depictions of how reporters surface issues, trace rumors, and verify facts. Robert Redford and Dustin Hoffman portray Washington Post journalists Bob Woodward and Carl Bernstein as they relentlessly pursue facts. And Jason Robards won the Best Supporting Actor Oscar for his portrayal of Post Editor Ben Bradley's fearless guidance, his doubts, and dedication to seeing fact-based, substantiated reports published in his newspaper. All the President's Men runs 2 hours 18 minutes and is rated PG. Nominated for eight Academy Awards, including Best Picture, it won four. Best Actor for Robards, Best Adapted Screenplay for William Goldman, Best Art Direction, and Best Sound. All the President's Men remains timely for the issues it raises about political crime and media credibility. The film inspired a generation of journalists, changed the way political information is conveyed and perceived, and that continue to shape our nation. For more on tonight's film, please watch my extended remarks at ksps.org slash snc and on social media. And now it's deadline time. Here's All the President's Men on Saturday Night Cinema. exactly as scheduled at 9.30 in the Capitol Plaza so that he can go up the steps of the House of Representatives, go into the chamber, and address the members of the House and the Senate, the Supreme Court, the Diplomatic Corps of Washington, all of whom are inside waiting for him in the chamber of the House of Representatives. Mr. Speaker, the President of the United States. The President, accompanied by the Escort Committee, comes down the central aisle, approaching the podium. Each members of his cabinet, and those who are waiting to be confirmed as members of his cabinet, as he reaches the roster. He shakes hands with the Speaker, Carl Albert. Happy President, smiling. Ladies and gentlemen, President Nixon will, in a moment, address the Congress and the people of the United States. 